Hi, my name is Lane Leach. I'm a services delivery engineer with Pinnacle Business Systems. And today we're in Oklahoma City at our longtime customer, HAC Incorporated. They're a regional operator of supermarkets, pharmacies, uh, uh, fuel centers, and convenience stores. And they've asked us to come back today to help update some critical components of their IBM power systems and their IBM I uh, operating system environments. So. They place a really high value on this because these systems support their primary ERP applications, which are absolutely mission critical. And right now, we're focusing on system consoles and flexible, system, flexible service processor or FSP firmware updates. So a reliable updated system console has always been critical to the IBM I operating system across the many hardware technology generations that IBM has brought to the market, all the way back system 34, 36, 38, the AS400, uh, and, and now the new power systems that we, we find that we're deploying today. Um, so most of the critical uh, systems management functions, whether it's uh, operating system upgrades or whether it's uh, watching your system IPL or whether the, maybe the uh, IBM field services engineer is coming out to uh, work on your system, replace a disk drive, troubleshoot something, when he or she gets here, they're going to want a reliable systems console. And whether it's a PC LAN console or a full-blown HMC uh, harbor management console, maybe in a redundant uh, HMC configuration, you need to have the confidence and know that it's ready to use at an, at just at a moment's notice. Um, so upgrading to a new version of the HMC code or installing the uh, updated uh, IBM Access Client Solutions, which is the new uh, Java-based platform independent product for, for uh, uh, connectivity to consoles and, and clients to access IBM I, that might seem like a, a real daunting task for the first time, but you, typically it's something that can be performed and completed within just an hour or two and it's it's normally uh, something that can always be accomplished uh, in a fair you know uh, with non disruptively to your system so that you won't have to interrupt your, your current business operations or, or or disrupt your user community at all. And when it comes to keeping your firmware updated, uh, doing that positions your server to be ready for the latest uh, in IBM I, uh, IBM hardware announcements, uh, new operating system releases, uh, as well as allowing you to take advantage of uh, new virtualization enhancements that are brought to us through uh, uh, PowerVM and VIO server. So, and again, many of these flexible service processor firmware updates can be performed non-disruptively, especially if you're already in the habit of keeping them fairly current. So. If consoles and firmware are on your mind and you're not sure if you're on the right track, give us a call. We'd love to talk to you. So we'll be right back in a few minutes to talk some more about program temporary fixes and IBM I operating system upgrades. Talk to you soon.